Hi Leos, welcome to Antique Tarot. Today we're doing your love reading for June 2022. So this card is out here because it came out in the pre-shuffle not once but like three times in two different decks because I was going to use a different deck for you guys and the devil came out on in that deck twice and then I decided to just use a different deck and then it came out again in this deck. So there's, you guys are either in a very toxic codependent relationship or something very unhealthy. You guys are, are, are trapped or was trapped in this illusion, negativity, something very, um, you know, or something very addicting, addictive, or sex, drugs, alcohol, substance abuse, whatever it is something that's very toxic either the person or the situation the circumstance whatever it is it keeps coming on coming out so just wanted to bring that to your attention you may or may not already be aware of it so i call on all my guys angels and masters to help me be a clear channel for the leo collective who will be watching this video what is going on with the leo collective who will be watching Okay, so there is a new start for you guys. A new solid start, a new offer of some sort. Perhaps even a new uh, job offer because this is pentacles. Money. A, a, like a fresh start with this white lily. A new fresh start for you guys. After all that toxicity, yeah, the hermit. So you guys may have been spending some time alone. By yourself isolating yourself and you're seeing the light it gave you uh, some clarity in regards to this new start or clarity in regards to that toxic relationship to to have a new start yeah you've been there's been heavy burden on your shoulders this comes out I think a couple uh, readings back where you guys have a, you know, you're carrying a lot on your shoulders. A lot of obligations, a lot of burdens. Some heavy heaviness. But the seeds you have planted is going to come to fruition. Your hard work, everything you've planted and uh, put the effort in is going to blossom. This is like a farmer planting all the seeds and pulling the weeds and watering and fertilizing. And all of it's going to come to fruition. So all your hard work, all your investment, all your time, your energy, your sweat, your tears that's going into this relationship or the person or in your whatever whatever this is that you have planted seeds for in the past is going to come to fruition and it's time to harvest. So you get to reap your the rewards of the fruits that you planted. Yeah, you you you're like I hear you're on high alert. Like you you have your guard up, you're on guard. You're taking this stance wounded soldier been beaten in battle but still standing standing in guard so you guys may be defensive or taking a stance defending yourself not backing down defending your ideas your belief your passion king of swords there may be an air sign involved so a gemini an aquarius or a libra that you may be dealing with if not there may be a lawyer sometimes this can be a, a lawyer involved someone that's very cold cruel heartless knight of swords so you have king and knight of swords something coming in and then we have queen of swords as well wow there's a lot of air around you so there there may be a lot of air people around you forward movement yep moving forward moving forward Leaving the darkness behind. See, one is black and one is white. You're going to move forward into lightness, into purity. That's why we have this new start, new beginning. With all this fresh lily that I noticed, pure white. See, this one is the dark black side. You're going to leave that behind, that devil behind. Now you're going to move forward. You're going to manifest because the magician came out a couple times in the pre-shuffle. You're going to manifest and create a new a new life. You're going to use your skills to manifest. As I say that, we have the Ten of Cups. Yeah, you're going to move forward. You're going to create a new happy home, happy family. 
fulfillment, happiness, emotional fulfillment. Yep, three pentacles. Yep, working. Yep, you're working, rebuilding, building something into fruition. That's why you're going to get the, the, the fruits, the harvest of your hard work. King of Cups. So there may be an offer from a water sign, a Cancer, a Pisces, or Scorpio offering his cup to you, offering his emotion, coming towards you, making an offer, a proposal of some sort, or expressing his feelings, and wish fulfillment. Yeah, so you are you guys are working on building a new, a new foundation, new family, new happiness. You get a water sign coming in, or someone coming in to make an offer, and it's going to be your wish fulfillment. Wow. Your heart's desire. Yeah, page of one. Yeah, my heart desire. Six of cups. So, someone's going to come in and make an offer. So here you have the king of cups offering you his cup of emotion. And then you have a guy offering flowers. Wow, nice. Very genuine, pure. The white flower stands out. Very, very nice gesture. Pure, genuine, sincere gestures that's gesture that's why you have this new start with this new purity and abundance and blessing from above you deserve it yeah a whole new world new planning so this new guy may show you a whole new world you might even go travel with him this new guy yeah you're gonna walk away from someone or something that no longer satisfy you or fulfill you, fulfill your your desire, your soul, your need. Yeah, walking away from that heartbreak. You had a major heartbreak. You felt trapped. You were trapped with that damn devil. You know, the, the two people were buying and chain. And you're healing right now. Yep, some of you may be in isolation, healing yourself. Spending a long time with yourself. Yep, healing, trying to balance. And there's the light. So your guys, your angel may be helping you heal as well. And then you're going to take this new leap of faith. New start. New start, new journey. Vic victory, victorious. You're going to come out victorious. You're going to make it through. So we have King of Pentacles. So there may be an earth sign that's prominent as well. A Virgo, uh... Capricorn or a Taurus. Alright. So we have Page of Wands and then we have Knight of Pentacles and then we have the Lovers as well. But I'll put that back and just shuffle some more. So Spirit Guides, Angels, Sun and Masters. Any additional messages for Leo Collective in Love for June 2022? Additional messages for Leo in love for June 2022. What is going on with Leo in love for June 2022? This one is sticking out. Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, solid foundation. Look. Have the dogs, loyalty, children, abundance, nice home. Yeah, very stable. This earth sign, very stable. They're going to provide a new solid so home look bottom of the deck we have the sun happiness you guys S brighter days sunny days it's coming in there's a song that the brady bunch sing you know how the the whole all the six kids was uh singing recording in a, a st studio brighter happy days or happy days are coming or something that's what i feel for you guys that's really good. Yeah, Six of Pentacles. It's going to be a more balanced relationship. A generous relationship. A balance, equal, give and take. And it may even be Twin Flame. It sort of feel like Twin Flame energy. If it's not Twin Flame, then uh, then it doesn't resonate. Then someone that's, that's more your caliber. More equal to you. More balanced for you. All right, so it looks good. I don't think there's anything else. Yeah, you're going to be... Look, we have the Nine of Pentacles, 
you're going to be sovereign, independent. This lady is very comfortable in her skin. She takes care of herself. She's all set. And then underneath that, we have two of cups coming together. Coming together. And look, underneath that is justice. Karmic balance. Scale of balance. And will of fortune is destined to change. Destined to change. All these cards come out are light, man. Reading after reading. Yeah, this came out in the pre-shuffle lot too. Trust your intuition. Trust your intuition. We have the star. Yeah, wish fulfillment. Healing, balancing your emotions going to balance out. Yep, and the knight of wands coming in. Full of passion. Very nice, very nice uh, reading, Leos. Very nice. So let's see the surrender cards. So spirit guides, angels, and masters, please help me, oh, I was going to say, please help me be a clear channel, which is what I normally say, that too, but what is the final messages for Leo, what, okay, surrender to beauty of the natural world, take a relaxing break and spend time in nature, replenish yourself by feeling the beauty and ecstasy there. It sounds like you guys are because you, you have the Four of Swords healing and then you also have the uh, the Hermit card. Yeah, taking time out, alone time for yourself. Yeah, and bottom of the deck is surrender to inner peace. Just be still, meditate, time alone and surrender the drama. Surrender the drama and let it go. Surrender to creativity, be creative. And surrender to divine timing. Surrender to complete healing, which you are, because we have that Four of Swords. And temperance and the star healing, balancing. And I say you guys are healing your emotion, balancing your emotion. Yep. And surrender to the idea you can fix someone. This comes out a lot in readings. I guess a lot of people try to fix or change a partner. Surrender to denial, because you may have been trying, you know, trying to deny what you know about them. Surrender outdated beliefs about yourself. Surrender to your intuition, which we have. So it's just confirming which which was that that uh, which was that uh, queen, the high priestess. Remember, I said she came out a lot in the pre-shuffle, at least two or three times. So it's the fourth time. Surrender to your intuition. I said, trust your intuition. Yeah, trust your intuition, Leo. It's important that you do that. And surrender your belief in scarcity if you're worried about funds or money or anything. Surrender to effortlessness. Let go and release. And surrender to the magic of who you are. That's that nine of um, nine of pentacle energy. Nine of pentacles energy. I said the lady, she's comfortable in her own skin. Independent, carefree, uh, wealthy. All right, uh, Leo, I'm going to leave it there. It seems pretty clear cut. We don't need any clarifier. Everything is clean and clear. You're going to have this new, beautiful, pure start with what it feels like a twin flame energy coming in. If not, definitely someone more balanced, more equal with you, more, uh, more equal balance, give and take. Very balanced energy, healing energy more to your I was going to say liking but more to your level you know who is who's more on your level all right Leos I'm going to leave it there wishing you all the best love and light to you let me know uh, in the comments if it resonated and I will catch you again in the next video bye Leos